Beggars can't be choosers, but beggars never quit. Height here, and you already know what this is. It's time for choosing beggars. Let's do it. Our first one is by Honey Glass Bottle. Love it until you make people pay for certain fonts. I can get other fonts from other sites and sure don't have to pay for certain ones. It should be free. All of it. I guess I'm going to look for another one. Sure not going to pay for something I can get free somewhere else, and it's all free. Read fonts, but for the charging for fonts? Really? Gong to lose a lot of users for charging. Or maybe they're putting in time and effort to create something and they're providing that to other people and deserve to be paid for it. This next one is from Cute Kid A. <laughs> Thanks. Any other questions? Nope. On my way now. Thumbs up. Are you safe? Just checking in and making sure you're okay. Wow. No one bought it yet? Why? Because I reserved it for you and turned down offers, but you never showed up, so I had to start again from scratch. It's just weird your isn't selling. Do you have more pictures? <laughs> Do you think I'm scamming? I have it booked for another person right now at any rate, but it's literally because I had it reserved for you and you didn't show up. If you hadn't had me book it for you, I wouldn't have had to turn down other people. You put it up as available that same day. <laughs> it's still nothing. Send me pics and I'll pick it up after work. No, sorry. I don't trust that you'll show up. You're so ugly to be honest. Since you left me hanging last time. Thanks. I know I am. <laughs> Let me know. I'll buy it. No, you won't buy it because you left them hanging and they're selling it to someone else. But apparently you don't understand that. This next one is by GK Contra. Looking for an occasional babysitter. We are looking for one on Valentine's Day, day or night. We will not pay an arm and a leg. So if that's what you charge, don't waste either of our times. Must be dog friendly. We have two. You're asking for a babysitter on a premium day where everybody's going to be looking for a babysitter because, well, those that have significant others would like to spend time with those special people. You can't expect somebody to watch your kids for pennies on the dollar when they can get hundreds on the bill. This next one is from Fearless Flatworm 49 So fucking livid. Need to vent. Whoever knows me. Please, don't even judge me. I'm not in the mood. So today, my man brings me a gift. A nice Tiffany & Co bag. And so I thought, ooh, something pricey, something nicey. I open it and there's a the ring. Now it has no engagement ring, but instead a promise ring. I faked a smile and gave him a kiss. Whatever real reason, I'm mad. As I went home and at the bottom bag was the receipt. I'm assuming in case the ring doesn't fit or need exchanging. But I got home, checked the receipt, and it was $70! So fucking mad that he thinks it's all I'm worth. Tomorrow I'm refunding it and buying myself something I'll actually enjoy. So mad. <laughs> so mad that you have somebody that cares about you that bought you a ring. It may not have been the most expensive ring, but it's the thought that counts, and the fact that they're even with you should say something. But with an attitude like yours, you're most likely going to end up being dumped and being alone for a very long time. This next one is by Turtler17. Sends pick. I do sometimes. What do you have in mind? Well, it could be just paid posts or some kind of barter. So far, I'm working with these two options. Me pay you? Sorry, just to specify, you want me to both pay you to post about my product and give it to you for free? Hey, well, I understand that you have a store and you sell your goods, and I have an audience that these products might be interested in. That's not really clearing up my question. Basically, yes, you pay for posts with your ads and I post them in my community. Right. Okay. Hate to point this out, but cumulatively, I have 40,000 more followers than you. And I'm not going to lie. 
it's beyond clueless of you to not only be asking for free work that I put many hours into, but also ask me to pay you to do it when there's a pandemic on. Many artists are really struggling right now, and the fact that you're asking for free shit for exposure when a lot of artists can't even pay their bills is, to put it lightly, so thick-headed a geologist would call you a medical miracle. Also, you're a Warhammer page that posts Warhammer pictures. I don't do Warhammer shit. Man, I'm helping a lot of artists right now. You don't give out your goods for free either, do you? I'm glad for the number of your subscribers. I hope that this figure does not stand still. Good luck. I do actually. I do giveaways. What I don't do is give them out to people who A, send even from the same content field as me and B, think that it's appropriate in a pandemic to ask for free work and payment on top. I don't even do Warhammer stuff, my dude. If people want to take your deal, that's up to them. But personally, I think it's a ludicrous suggestion. Well then, this conversation doesn't make sense. You tell me that you give out your product for free, but you have prices in the store at 150 pounds a mug. Okay. I give out mugs to content creators in my field with a high follower count. I have given items to Quissy's Tavern, who has over 3 million followers and is D&D based. I do monthly giveaways to my followers. I've also traded with other artists. And I'm sorry, but again, what the hell is your justification that Warhammer has anything to do with what I do? I don't think they have any justification at all. I think what they're desperately trying to justify is the fact that they think they should get something for free when in fact they don't and are not entitled to it at all. This next one is from McLove. You do art requests? Huh? Requests as in commission? What do you mean by commission? You know, paying for arts and all? Absolutely not. Why does it not surprise me that choosing beggars always try to pretend that they don't know what commission means when in fact we all know they really do? This next one is by Siva Kurata. We are looking for a site engineer, intern, to join our company. The following are the requirements. 1. BE B Tech 2020 Pass Out 2. Should be based in here 3. Should have a laptop PC in case of work from home 4. Should have a bike to visit the site 5. Male candidate is preferred Note: This is not a paid internship. Interested candidates send your resume through a personal message in LinkedIn. My question is, how much work are they actually going to have this unpaid intern doing? If going from the past is anything to go by, we know it's going to be an overloaded, ridiculous amount of work. And our final one is from Dax Batty. Hi, is this Blue? Yes, how can I help you? Yeah, so I saw your ad for the PlayStation 2 and was wondering if you would lower the price a bit, since it is flashed and therefore the warranty is void. The price is $70 with more than 100 games and 2 controllers, 2 memory cards. I will drop it to $65, but not lower than that. A bit much since the warranty is void. I will give you $15 if you ship tomorrow, and I think that's fair. Dude, you realize that this is a PS2. 2. It's like 15 years old and in near perfect condition for its age, so I will drop to $60 and that's it. Oh, so it is old as fuck and you're asking 60 bucks. Be realistic, it's not worth that man. I will give you 10 and I'm being generous. No thanks, if you want a new one, go to the store. Otherwise, quit wasting my time and yours please. Man, fuck you, dude. You broke ass. Can't afford the new one. That's why you mad. <laughs> Take the 10 and shut the fuck up. You're talking about mad, but yet you're sitting there getting mad at them because they don't want to sell it to you for 15. Oh, wait, I'm sorry. You dropped it down to 10 after they explained to you that it was a PlayStation 2. <laughs> Good luck not getting that PS2. All right. That's enough beggars for the day. Well, that wraps up this episode of Choosing Beggars. If you liked the video, please drop a like, share my content on all of your social media, subscribe if you haven't already, and make sure to hit that bell. It really helps my channel out. And drop a comment down below. Thanks for watching. Thanks to my patrons. Have a great day and stay safe out there.